Are you familiar with the word plantar fasciitis? It's a condition that affects the heel and sole of the foot, causing pain, stiffness, and discomfort. It's actually quite common, affecting 1 in 10 people at some point in their lives, especially middle-aged and older adults, athletes, and people who spend a lot of time on their feet. So if you suffer from plantar fasciitis and are looking for ways to ease the pain and discomfort, well, in this video, we're going to explore one of the most popular solutions, compression socks. So if you're curious to know whether compression socks can help alleviate the symptoms of plantar fasciitis, then this video is a must-watch. At CloudStep, we team up with foot health experts to bring exceptional content to our community. Stay tuned and enjoy this valuable information. If you're experiencing pain in the heel or sole of your foot, especially when taking the first steps in the morning or after a period of rest, it could be a sign of plantar fasciitis. Other symptoms include stiffness or tightness in the foot, swelling or inflammation in the heel or sole, tenderness or soreness of the foot, and difficulty walking or standing for a long period. So, what causes plantar fasciitis? It's believed to be related to repetitive stress or strain on the plantar fascia, which is a thick band of tissue that runs along the bottom of the foot. Risk factors include overuse or repetitive strain from sports activities, flat feet or high arches, worn out shoes, being overweight or obese, and aging. Now let's talk about treatment. In most cases, conservative measures are recommended as a first-line treatment, such as rest, avoiding activities that aggravate the pain, mobility exercises, ice, and wearing adequate shoes or insoles that provide cushioning and arch support. But if those don't work, it's time to contact your doctor for additional measures. And that's where compression socks come in. Compression socks are a type of sock that applies gentle pressure to the lower limb, improving circulation and reducing swelling. They can be an effective tool for managing the symptoms of plantar fasciitis, particularly if the pain is caused by inflammation. The gentle pressure can help reduce swelling and improve blood flow to the affected area, as well as support the foot and ankle by reducing strain on the plantar fascia. When choosing compression socks for plantar fasciitis, it's important to select socks that provide the right level of compression. Most compression socks are rated based on their level of compression, which is measured in millimeters of mercury. For this condition, socks with a compression level of 15 to 20 millimeters of mercury are usually recommended. It's also crucial to choose compression socks that fit well and are comfortable to wear, so make sure to try them on before buying. Remember, while compression socks can help alleviate the symptoms of plantar fasciitis, they may not be enough to fully treat the condition. Further measures should be taken into consideration, as recommended by your healthcare professional. So, give compression socks a try and see if they can provide some relief for your plantar fasciitis pain. So, there you have it, folks, the answer to the burning question. Can compression socks ease plantar fasciitis pain? While compression socks can be an effective tool for managing the symptoms of plantar fasciitis, it's important to understand that they may not be a complete solution to treating the condition. It's essential to speak with your healthcare professional to create a comprehensive treatment plan that fits your individual needs. That being said, if you're struggling with the pain and discomfort of plantar fasciitis, compression socks could be an excellent addition to your treatment regimen. Give them a try and see if they help you find some relief. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your journey against foot pain in the comments below. Make sure to visit cloudstep.com to explore our products and gain access to exclusive content created by our team of experts. You'll find the link in the description below.